Hi guys, my name is Sam and this is a beginner uh, conversation class about um, restaurants and eating out. Hi Giovanni. Hi beautiful teacher, how nice are you? Nice to see you. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't it, it, seen you in a little while. W where? <laughs> Have you been? I haven't, I haven't seen you in, I don't know, a week or so, maybe? Have you been busy? Uh, I don't remember. But, Taking lots uh, of classes? <laughs> yes, of course. In, in this period, I'm on vacation and uh, I'm taking advantage of this to study oh, English. And, uh, oh, there is my, my friend, my friend Furkan, <laughs> my Turkish friend, a, a real actor. I suggest you to study to to study as the actor. Uh, oh, where's the sound coming from? From Vincenzo. Should study theater. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think you would be good at that. You can um, talk to Lauren. Lauren uh, minored in drama, I think. Yeah, she asked me uh, yeah. whether or not if I. Taking other classes, I said no. And yeah. Alberto. Hello. In the dark room. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey. Yeah. So I am a bad boy, and my father <laughs> sent me here with the mice. To the basement. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and mm. hi, Vincenzo. <laughs> Okay, Vincenzo, we have some crazy sounds happening there. Okay, maybe he'll refresh. That was um, a bit loud. <laughs> um, so, today uh, we're talking about restaurants and eating out. So, to warm up, what's your favorite meal? Hmm. I'm going to try to think of a new favorite meal because I have a lot and I always say the same thing. I always say yeah. steak, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, my favorite meal, my, one of my other favorite meals besides steak is uh, seafood pasta. I like you pasta with it. food in it. Pardon? You said it before. Well, that's because it's my favorite. Okay, what else? Um, lobster? Have I said lobster? Oh, yeah. okay. Mm. Oh well, my one of my favorite foods is lobster, um, and I have lots of favorite foods. I like surf and turf. Have you heard of this before? Wow, no. Surf and turf? Ah, something new, but not really. Surf and turf is when you eat some sort of meat from the turf, the ground. So usually like steak or beef, and then some sort of seafood on oh. the same plate. So like steak with Shrimp, yeah. or <laughs> that's one of my favorites. Um, Alberto, what is your favorite meal? Wow, uh, it's difficult for me to explain because uh, uh, this is a Spanish food, and I don't know if uh, there is a name. Um, yeah, it's like a. a Stoop, stoop. Uh, can you type I, it? Yeah. We can go to a translator and find out what it is. <laughs> stew. Oh, stew. It's the same in English. Is that a Spanish word? Stew? Mm. It's like a yeah. soup, kind of thick, usually with meat and potatoes in it. Uh, no potatoes. No. Uh, it's a. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Uh, is it with uh, all the seafood, it's, it's that kind? Yeah, oh. there are a lot of things Pi inside. Pi what is it? Paella? Chickpea. 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 Yeah, is it this? Eh? Like... Oh, no, paella no, it's different. <laughs> paella is with rice. This is with... Uh, chick Chickpeas? Chick yeah, chickpeas. Mm -hmm. Chickpea. Love. With this. 
chickpea, meat, also vegetables, hmm. and all put together. And uh, with this sauce, we made uh, first uh, a soup with pasta, pasta, mm -hmm. this, uh, this soup, and later with, with the, the chickpea and the meat and that things. Mm -hmm. It's a uh, one uh, one meal for all the for all the meal. There are no different uh, desert. Uh, there are no the different uh, first, second, and the cool. Okay, awesome. And hi, Alex. Hi, hi, Sam. What's your favorite meal? My favorite meal, um, mm -hmm. maybe borscht. My national meal. Borscht. Yes, you know. How it? do you, how do you spell I, I guessed. Kind of. I spelled it like Porsche. Who would it be? Yes, maybe. Yes. It's because I'm I'm googling everyone's favorite foods to see what they look like. Borscht, it's, like this. It's soup. Yes. It's like a soup. Yes. What is what's inside? It looks like cabbage. Yes, it is. Ah. Okay. Yeah. Shrimp. Hmm. Okay. Cool. And hi, Andre. Nice to see you. Hi. Andre, what's <coughs> your favorite meal? Mm, my favorite meal is borscht too, because it's uh, it's national mm -hmm. meal. Mm, also, very like uh, meat. Mm, barbecue. Barbecue. Cool. Sounds good. And hello, Christelle. Hey. Hi, how are you? Fine. Are you on your iPad? Yeah, I am. Oh, cool. Um, where are you from? <laughs> France. Oh, great. Uh, what's your favorite meal? I don't know, really. Like maybe I would say um um crab maybe. Mhm. Mm cool. <laughs> um, seafood. Yeah, seafood. I would say. Yeah, me too. Oh, seafood. seafood. Mhm. Mm I like. Awesome. Cool. Um, I I I know they said uh you just started to be able to use iPad, right? For. Mhm. Mm yeah, that's pretty cool. So you're the first student I've seen on an iPad. So I'm like, whoa, <laughs> it's new now. It's moving around, <laughs> but it's cool. Okay, awesome. And Giovanni, what is your favorite meal? Okay, I don't want to be boring, but my favorite dish is pasta, of course. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a simple man, and uh, you have to taste. You have to eat pasta. And because uh, it's the healthiest dish in, in the world. And what kind of I pasta? I suggest this, this kind of pasta. It's a, it's a particular type of pasta, an handmade pasta with uh, tomato sauce on it and, uh, and the cheese. This like is a. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm. yeah. Look, that looks look good. Look at the colors, the white, the white of the pasta, the red of the tomato sauce, and uh, and the green of the basilicum, you know, and uh, it's, basil. It's, it's our, basil, it's our, it's our, sorry, basil, ba basil. yes, basil, yes, mm -hmm. it's our, it's our mm -hmm. national plate, pasta. Mm -hmm. Yum. <laughs> Uh oh, I'm gonna be hungry again after this class. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta stop with the food classes. <laughs> Killing me. <laughs> okay, uh Firkin, what's your favorite meal? Can I just share their photos? Because yeah, sure. they have local names. Okay. okay. Here they are. There are three. Okay. You can't One. share it on your screen. Oh, okay. Wait, where's the screen share? Bob? S. Okay, look at this. The first one. Okay. They're all meat products, so there's nothing that I can know about it. First one, the second one. This is a lamb and mm -hmm. rice. 
And the last one, I don't know what it was made, but it must be like a beef. Bro. What is it with the <laughs> lamb? Is it mint? Mm. Ah, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And carrot on all the other side. Mm. You know, you can find all of those stuff everywhere. Yeah. Like it's full of them. Almost in every uh -huh. corner. I love lamb. <laughs> you come here, you'll see a lot. It's one of my favorite meats. Yeah. Um. Oh, Giovanni and Vincenzo, the Italians. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, I bet he can. I will find out. <laughs> Hi, because, Olga. Uh, yeah. Yes, because. Uh, Hi. Because... Sorry, uh, Giovanni. Were you gonna say no. something? No, I would like to explain that every our region have a particular kind of pasta. So, if I mentioned orecchiette, I belong to a particular region. Okay. Uh, really? That's it. Yes, that's it. But you can't tell us which one. We don't know uh, where Vincenzo is from yet. Yeah, pasta wars. <laughs> Verbling edition. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, we'll find out. I'll ask Vincenzo when we get over there. Um, Olga, where are you from and what's your favorite meal? I'm from Russia. And but my favorite meal is plov. So P L O V. Plov, plov. yes. Mm -hmm. It is um, fried meat with uh, carrot. Okay, it's in middle. Like this one. Yes, yes, this one, and uh, with uh, onions and rice. Mm. It's very, very, very delicious. <laughs> yeah, it looks good. What's the what kind of meat? Uh, some and and pork and beef and uh, uh, lamb. Mm -hmm. It's um and when you're pronouncing it, it's uh, onions, onions. On onions. Okay. Uh, yeah, it looks like on, but it's un like this. Onions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cool. Okay. And uh, Ruby, hi Ruby. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Where are you hi. from, and what is your favorite meal? Okay, I'm from Mexico, and of course, my favorite food is all kind of Mexican food. I, I like uh, spicy food, but I also like uh, uh, seafood. Mm -hmm. Is there a certain kind of spicy food you like? Uh, well, um, I like every kind of spicy food. Everything oh. that is spicy is good for me. As long as it's spicy, you're good. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> I've never had proper Mexican food. I've only had like the North, the, like the Canadian version or American version of Mexican food. But it's completely different. Thing. I know. That's what I, re <laughs> I remember. Um, Renee, another student. I miss Renee. I haven't seen him in a long time, but. Rene used to tell us about Mexican food, and he would ask, you know, so what's your idea of a taco? <laughs> tell him, yes. you know, that is so not what a taco is. <laughs> Same with like quesadilla and everything. Yes, I know American people have a different idea of a uh, taco. He says it's completely it's different, different yeah. from what I think. Yeah, so I have yeah. to go to Mexico and try it. Yes, I love spicy right. food. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> that's good. Yeah. I'll come visit you and eat eat all your. Okay, that's, that's good. <laughs> cool. Um, and Vincenzo. Hi. Hey. And uh, my favorite food uh, is uh, salad because I'm vegan and don't uh, eat uh, meat or uh, fish. <laughs> what What's your favorite? Can you spell it? Sorry. Did you? What was your favorite dish? Uh, sorry, I don't understand. It's okay. Uh, what is dish. your your favorite meal dish? Uh, uh, salad or uh, pizza, but uh, without uh, <laughs> yes, vegan pizza without mm -hmm. cheese or uh, without uh, meat. Right. Do you use a cheese substitute? Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. Like uh, tofu or uh, like uh, soya, mm -hmm. soya cheese. Um, my brother and his girlfriend are vegan, and uh -huh. they made a big dinner last night for 
um, her sister came over and they made uh, really big lasagna and salads and all sorts of stuff and it was all vegan and I swear I would not have known that it was vegan. She's so good. She can cook like anything and desserts too. So, um, cool. Um, okay, well let's ask each other some, oh wait, you didn't answer Giovanni. Giovanni, what is your favorite kind of pasta again? What was it called? Orecchiette. Okay, Vincenzo, what part of Italy do you think Giovanni is from? <laughs> um, my favorite pasta is uh, lasagna, <laughs> but uh, without uh, uh, with, uh, eggs. Vincenzo, <laughs> can I... Okay, uh, can you guess my region? Uh, if I told you that uh, orecchiette is my is our regional dish, which is well, region? Well, uh, orecchiette is a uh, bo Emilia Romagna. Bo oh my God! <laughs> you are not Italian. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> The, the first Italian that is not an Italian man. <laughs> so I guess he didn't. I guess he didn't guess correctly. I don't know what happened. <laughs> no. What's your region, Giovanni? Okay. Uh, okay. My region oh, is yeah. Apulia. You know. Ah, okay. Yeah. Yes. Apulia, as Italy is shaped like a boot, Apulia is just the heel. Ah, okay. Yes. And, and um the national and dish is is orecchiette al sugo. Uh, okay. And Vincenzo, uh, w what's your area? Uh is uh, Abruzzo. So what's your pasta? <laughs> your yeah. region? Who your uh, regional pasta? <laughs> I'm learning. Uh, I'm learning is, today about everyone's, you know. Is it is quagliatelli original yeah. pasta? <laughs> uh, whatever <laughs> that is, it sounds delicious. So I'm yeah. I'm in. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, let's ask each other some other questions about restaurants and everything else. So um, we'll start with um, uh, Christelle. Can you see my screen when I have it up like this? Yeah, yeah. I, okay, cool. I can see it. Um, I have only I have it on my computer, so I could you know um, watch at the same time. Oh, okay, perfect. Um, so why don't you choose a question for someone in class, whoever you want? Let me see. Um, I can't see it properly because um, wait, let me see. Okay, good, good, good. Okay. Um, let me see. Uh, do you know how to order food in English? Okay, let's ask um, Ruby. Okay. Um, the question was if I know how to order food in English? Yeah. Okay, yes, I think I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. So, um, hello ma'am, what can I get for you today? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I, I ask uh, I ask for the menu, menu. So may I have yeah. the menu, please? And so <laughs> then I can see what they have. Okay, hold on. Uh, okay, hold on. Uh, Hello, ma'am. I'm gonna find one for you. <laughs> wait, wait while I find my menu. Mm. So then, when I, I'm ready, I, I, I could I could say um, make half a pasta or something. <laughs> I don't know. Here you go. Okay, okay, <laughs> I, I could see the menu. Okay, may may have a chef salad, please. A chef salad. Chef salad. everything. And um and something to drink like uh, soda. All right. That'll be eleven seventy five. <laughs> it's very expensive, right? <laughs> I can't find the drink menu. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. I'm new here. I'm new. I don't know. I've never I've never done this before. <laughs> okay. Good, Ruby. So you would say, Can I please have whatever? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. Okay, Ruby, why don't you choose a question for someone in class? Okay. 
Um, I'm going to ask Alex. Uh, how often do you eat out? How often I eat? How often? How often do you eat out? What does it mean? Eat out? Um, go out for dinner at a restaurant. Oh, I see. Uh, approximately maybe one time per week with mm -hmm. my friends or on a date in some restaurant, yes. But not usually. And yeah. when you do eat out, what sort of restaurant do you and your friends usually go to? I don't know, some tasty restaurant with, I don't know, tasty McDonald's? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I'm, now I'm not eating McDonald's and mm -hmm. any fast foods, no. Why? Because I'm trying to improve my body and I can't eat it. Some burgers aren't free, I can't. Actually, I never love it. You're missing smile. something. What? You are missing something. I don't think so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you would say um, you're missing. You're missing out. You're missing out. Have you heard that expression before, guys? Yeah. Um, or, or there's something there missing. Something missing. There's something yeah. missing. Something if I say, ah, oh, you're missing out, it means, oh, you should really do it. It's awesome. And oh. you're, missing the, you're missing the fun. You're missing out. Okay. okay. <laughs> cool. Okay, good. Um, Alex, why don't you choose another question for someone else in class? Okay. Do you worry about calories and fat content when you eat out? For example, some question for girls and maybe Olga. Can I? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, when I, I eat out, I um, don't. Uh, um, I, I don't think. Don't make cars. You don't. Uh, you, you don't choose uh, calories. I. I um, mm. You're muted. Oh, I said I'm trying to find a question yes. in the list. Yes. <laughs> what is the question? What about calories and being a fat obsession? Ah, I found it. Okay. Uh, Do you worry sorry. about calories? So you could say, mm, no, I don't really care about calories or... Yes, I don't wa worry about calories. Mm -hmm. uh, why not? Because it's um, when we eat out, uh, we eat in a restaurant, it's uh, once a week. And at this time we meet, we meet with my friend. And <laughs> we don't worry about calories. Yeah, you're like, ah, I don't care about calories. I'm here to have a good time. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, good. Um, and now, back to our questions. Why don't you ask a question to who hasn't had one yet? Giovanni? Yes. Can I can I ask my question to my friend Furkan? <laughs> <laughs> okay, sure. Okay. The question is besides pasta, okay, 
Okay. Okay. This is interesting. Did you enjoy eating out in other countries you have visited? Yes. I haven't been to other countries. Maybe we should ask another question. Oh. Okay. It, it means that you you uh, didn't go. Uh, Not yet. Uh, oh, okay. Come to Italy as as your first country. Okay. Another one. Do you like Western food? Japanese, Thai, Italian. Uh, Western food like Italian. Yeah, I actually had a friend from Bologna, I guess, and he yeah. offered me, uh, he showed me a picture of pasta with a special sauce, I forgot its name, because it was Italian, and it was a spot with the different Italians, and they always talking about pizza and pasta, and I like pasta because I eat every day at lunch. <laughs> because it's too much pasta. No, no, no. no I, mean, I mean, besides Italian food, do you, oh. Have you ever have you ever tasted uh, have you ever tasted another type of yeah the Chinese uh, part, for example I've tried risotto tried to cook it by myself I sucked uh. at it it was horrible and <laughs> <laughs> so don't let Perkin cook risotto for you he'll burn it uh. <laughs> can you uh. can you at least cook pasta. Yeah, of course. For example, he says that I, he also example, he. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. Go ahead. Go, I I was saying that he said that he um eat, he eats um pasta every day, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But usually so, his mom cooks it for him. <laughs> 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 if he can't cook pasta, this is a uh, travesty. <laughs> <laughs> For, exa for example, can I ask, uh, can I ask for can if uh, have you ever eaten the foie gras or uh, escargot, uh, ah. typical, typical of, of France? Christelle, uh, do you like foie gras? Well, I'm from um, the West Indies and I just came in France for like study, and then I never ate, um, I never eat. Um, Escargot. I would love to taste it. I would love to try. Mm -hmm. But foie gras is moi. <laughs> yeah, this is so I love so, it. <laughs> this is so yummy. Very rich it? though. It's very rich. Yeah. And we love you. And we we love you. We love you. <laughs> yeah, this is really nice. For anyone if you're not sure it's um Right here, the oh oh the dear. the Let's top. Wait the wait, I'll one. I'll find a good picture. <laughs> so some of the pictures aren't very good. This one looks good, but it needs it needs some crackers or something to go with. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is so yummy. Mm -hmm, like this. What is this? It's um. Well, <laughs> it. It doesn't sound as delicious as it tastes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We'll just put it that way. <laughs> it's made from a um, liver duck. What it is? Enlarged uh, duck liver. Oh my god. Duck <laughs> liver. <laughs> <laughs> but okay. it's delicious. It really how, how you call nice. that? How you call? Yeah, that I believe you. You eat on a snail. <laughs> how you call that in English? Then. Well, we um. <laughs> Foie gras, it doesn't really have a name in English because okay. we don't really have it. So we would just call it foie gras. It, we just call it the same thing. Okay, um, okay. Um, but you would call it, I guess, like duck liver pate, but then pate isn't English either. <laughs> so we don't really have a name for it. Okay. Um, and no, you would not put that with, um, with snails. That would be really... No. <laughs> no. Mm -mm. No. <laughs> you're saying that snail tastes good. No, <laughs> not disgusting. with foie gras, though. Not. Why? Why? No, they don't go together. <laughs> mm -mm. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay, Furkan, it's your turn to choose a question. Mm. I'll put them. To who? 
Um, let's. Who hasn't had one? Uh, Andrew. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Andrew. Okay. Oof. Could it be about fast food or? Um... Whatever you want. Okay. Um, for example, if you go to a different country, would you eat? Would you try to taste their food that you haven't tasted it yet, or you go to Burger King or KFC or <laughs> McDonald's? No. To be, make, to be sure. No, of course I will try everything. <laughs> Uh, because I can eat in my country, I can go to McDonald's, go to KFC, and when I hungry, but not often. But if I go to, for example, from Mexico, I will try eat everything hot, mm, maybe hot meat, hot paper, mm -hmm. and so so. Um. I was just going to say, uh, in another class, um, before we were talking about this, Andre, and we were saying that sometimes people will eat fast food when they travel because they trust that they won't get food poisoning or something, <laughs> you know. That's uh, not true. Yeah. Yeah, but but would, you rather, would you rather try the local cuisine? <laughs> no, <clears throat> my colleague uh, in my work... Uh, few months ago uh, um, went to India and uh, on first day they try eat uh, national Indian food this was first time mm -hmm. when he eat after that he going every day to McDonald's or KFC uh oh yeah that's not very healthy <laughs> it's he told me but that it, it's very hot and uh, very different for our stomach. Right. But I think it would be better if you choose to eat a place that you know that's stressful or trustworthy. Because I remember whenever I went to my grandma's, uh, there's some kind of problem that, maybe not a problem, but I'm not used to drinking their waters that much. <laughs> and whenever I leave them, I'm like, uh, washing out. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, Andre, it's your turn. Okay. What about um, Alberto? Why don't you ask Alberto a question? Okay. Mm, let me choose. Question. Uh, Alberto, um, I want to ask you about uh, Gracie. Uh, do you ever do you ever eat Gracie food? Greasy, greasy, greasy. Greasy. Do you know what that greasy means? Food. Greasy food. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, yes, of course. Uh, in some in winter time, we have uh, here in Spain a uh, very greasy food because, for example, the the meal I told you at the first, the cocido, is uh, with a uh, lot of uh, um, meat, a lot of uh, greasy things from mm -hmm. the pork and also from another. Uh, uh, animals uh, and the um, the the sauce that uh, it uh, it is made with the meal uh, is very greasy. You have here in in the top on the top of the of the of the pot you have a lot of grease mm. water and it's very it's a, it has a good taste. Because it used to to mix with uh, pasta and make a, a, a different soup, mm -hmm. and it's very it's a real 
real is is very good, and also you can also uh, when here in Spain in several villages uh, they they kill the pork in in their homes with the veterinary and the the uh, the grace of the of the pork and uh, if you put on on the fire. Uh, is uh, is is very good uh, because it's uh, mm. um, I don't know it's like um, more or less like a bacon you know yeah uh, but uh, more natural and, so like uh, back bacon like back bacon like this back ba ah yeah back bacon like you this more you. or less yeah it's uh, it's like this but uh, it's uh, natural it's uh, fresh and but with more, uh, more, uh, it's gracey. Mm. Yeah. A lot of uh, there are a lot of gracey in mixes with the with the meat, mm -hmm. and it's uh, wow, real, <laughs> really uh, very good. Sounds Only delicious. Only for winter. <laughs> Only for winter, because if we eat now in summer time, <laughs> we die. <laughs> we will die. <laughs> Yeah. It, um. Let's let's pronounce that word together. Everyone, ready? Greasy. 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 Just like, just like the musical Grease. Yeah, like the musical Grease. Grease. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> Who's singing Grease? <laughs> Was that Giovanni? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We'll just have a Giovanni uh, concert after class. You can sing us like Greece is the word. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. a, a question. Greasy is the adjective. And the noun is grease? Yeah. If something has a lot like, of grease, like the it's film? very greasy. Grease. Uh, it's, it's the same name that like the film. So yeah. the this film. grease is from your hair and the other grease is for, for it. Yeah, well, reason. actually, there's different kinds of grease. So we have wow. grease, but, okay, so grease, grease. in your hair. <laughs> um, before, what they used to say was when you put gel in your hair yeah. to slick it back, they would call it hair grease. But now, if we say that someone has greasy hair, it means that they don't wash their hair enough. <laughs> and it looks like... Wet, oh. greasy. <laughs> um, that's grease in your hair. And then we use grease um, for our food, like you were saying with the pork or the back bacon. You have greasy bacon. Um, you also use grease to lo um, loosen joints. Like if you had a creaky door, then you would put grease on the hinge so it would stop creaking. Okay. It's another so three different kinds of grease. <laughs> Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. um, okay, good. Alberto, why don't you choose another question for us? Maybe for, um, I don't know, uh, Vincenzo? <laughs> Vincenzo, okay. Uh, when you have meals, when, do, when you eat, uh, what are the drinks uh, do you have in, in the meals? Red, red wine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but, but, uh, I, I, I don't like the, 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 the wine. I, I like uh, I, I like beer. And uh, but uh, every, every day uh, in my dinner uh, I drink uh, water. <laughs> beer um, when you're not eating. But water with your food? <laughs> no, uh, after the dinner, uh, <laughs> I drink beer. But, oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> but uh, uh, not in uh, in uh, in a dinner. Oh. Okay. Got it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. What does everyone else drink with dinner? Giovanni, uh, what do you drink with dinner? Ah, <laughs> uh, of course, that's wine. <laughs> and uh, never, I say, never water, only red wine. <laughs> Strictly <laughs> red wine. Only red wine. Only red wine. Every no, time. No, it's, it's true, because 
if you if you drink water, I think that the your meal is not so great. You, know, <laughs> yes, you are not to you are, you will not able to appreciate your meal if you drink water. Only red wine. For me, I drink red wine with certain things and white wine with other things. Like I, I'll have white wine with like seafood and chicken. Yeah, yeah. And then red wine with you know dark meats, oh, pastas usually. Um, yes. It but depends. maybe not every. I mean, it depends on what I'm eating. But I agree, yeah, yeah. water's kind of boring. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I still drink water. I can with hear dinner. the alcoholic. I yeah, to drink I drink water. water with dinner though. <laughs> so I'm like Vincenzo. <laughs> but Vincenzo still has his alcohol after. <laughs> uh -huh. You too. <laughs> Chris, Krista, what do you have with dinner? Juice. juice? Only juice. Yeah, that's. I like wine, not red wine, like Vincenzo. Mm -hmm. um, this is Vincenzo, right? Mm -hmm. uh, that was uh, Giovanni likes his red wine. Okay, so I don't, I hate red wine. I love white wine, uh, but I all, I only drink um, juice when I eat my meal. Mhm. Mm okay. Cool. Um, In okay, my country, so we, we sorry, have. Uh, who is uh, it? We have also oh, red wine. But uh, sometimes uh, it's, it's uh, very bad. But uh, we we have to drink it <laughs> because it's uh, it's uh, very bad to throw it. We mix with soda. <laughs> and, uh, wait, wait. Also, mix, what do you mix with soda? <laughs> Wet red wine. <laughs> wine. Wine. He comes with first. Soda. Wow! I've never uh, mixed wine. Wine with soda? is. Is forbidden by God. Throw, throw away the wine. <laughs> so. Okay, so it's a religious. Um, um, mhm, mm mhm. Um, said, um, and I'm the only one who doesn't drink alcohol. Do, who in class does not drink alcohol? Me. Me. Uh, Ruby. Ruby. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to see sometimes. Ruby so, doesn't drink alcohol. Ruby and Firkin. No. Anybody else? It's not that strange to not drink alcohol. <laughs> Lots yes, of I people know. don't I drink know. alcohol. I know. Mm -hmm. But I never drink alcohol. Cool. Why? Well, I don't like. I have never tried drinking alcohol. So. You should try. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Even every every meal I drink water, just water. I know it, some people think that water is boring, but uh, since my father got a, a diabetes, I start I started drinking more water. That's a good idea. And try to eat healthier, and you know. Because mm -hmm. I think oh. water seems boring, but I still always I drink water yeah. and. Yes, yes. <laughs> sure, whatever, but I'm just staying hydrated. <laughs> um, okay, let's do another question. Uh, Vincenzo, okay. why don't you choose one for us? And we'll just all answer it together. Uh, excuse me, I don't understand. Okay, Vincenzo, uh, you can choose a question. Uh, okay. Um... Two completed totalers. What was that? <laughs> uh, who pay when uh, you go out of for dinner? Mm -hmm. Ah, who pays? <laughs> so, um. Let's see who, who who wants to answer this one. Olga, who pays when you go out for dinner? My, My man, of course. Your man. <laughs> yes. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Does everyone here have a man to pay? What about of course. The man? What about no the man? <laughs> Even though he's not ours. Mm -hmm. Whenever I'm with friends, we always go Dutch. Yeah. Always, like we eat. And you know there are like twenty people, and if one people, but well, just one person tries to pay for everyone, 
that will be more of like two hundred dollars <laughs> per day. <laughs> so everyone is like, okay, let's go pay for ourselves, just ourselves. Mm -hmm. And we just leave there. Mm -hmm. What about you, Christelle? Who pays for your meals when when you're going out for dinner? Um, because um, well, my boyfriend most of the time, but yeah. we are students, so um, you we have to, you know, we are not. We don't have a tree with a lot of money, so I can understand sometimes we could do 50-50. So, um, but most of the time he pays. You guys heard this expression? You said we don't have a money tree, right? Yeah. <laughs> the expression, money doesn't grow on trees. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you'll split it 50-50 sometimes, or he'll pay. Mm -hmm. Can I say something about... Giovanni? Can I say something about... Yeah, yeah. Yes, I think that it, it, it's fair that uh, uh, a man pays uh, the dinner for uh, for his uh, woman. Mm -hmm. In my case, my problem is that my mother-in-law very very often comes to with us uh, when we eat out, and uh, she doesn't eat like a bird. <laughs> 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 so I have to pay a lot of money for her, and uh, I'm not so happy about. <laughs> Are you talking about your mother? <laughs> no, he's yeah, mother-in-law. Yeah, my, my mother-in-law. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hope she's not watching. Yeah, yeah I hope so. <laughs> so, um, but Giovanni, you think that it's fair for the man to pay? Yes, yes, I think yes. Uh, Italians are always gentlemen, authentic ones, and uh, every Italian man pays for, uh, for the dinner for uh, for, uh, for his uh, for his woman. In my case, mm -hmm. even for uh, my uh, mother-in-law. Okay. <laughs> Any other thoughts about that? Does that? What does everyone else think? Um. We have well, no, I, I, I could say that uh, when I go to eat out, uh, my husband pay, obviously, my husband pay. And my husband pays. And, but when I go to, to, when I go out to eat with some friends, uh, everybody pay uh, their own uh, bill. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. So you, yeah. yeah, that's what we do too. When I'm with friends, we just all pay for our own. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Unless it's like an occasion where you've told your friend that you're buying or whatever. Yeah. Mm. What about you, Alex? Who pays for dinner? If I'm on a dinner on a date, sure, I am pay always. <laughs> I, think, I think it's necessary. For men. Okay. Um, Andre, what do you think? Mm, sometimes I, sometimes my wife. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's good. Depends. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, all right. Let's look at another another one. Um, buffet. Do you guys like eating at buffets? Do you know what that is? A buffet. Yeah. yeah, I love that. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> you know what I do when I'm eating at a buffet? I like starve myself all day and then <laughs> go and <laughs> yeah. eat as much everybody, as I possibly can. Everybody does that. <laughs> Gotta get yeah. your money worth. <laughs> so, Olga, do you like eating at buffets? Yes, I do. I like. I like it. Mm hmm. And um, do you usually eat like three portions <laughs> or more? No. Especially all inclusive ones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I okay. can't understand those people that go to buff. How you say buffet? I, I can buff, choose. Buff, it. Well, within buffet. I, I can't understand the people buffet. that goes to buffet mm -hmm. and just eat uh, like one plate of food, like. Your I do that. For you to eat. No, you can't do that. You yeah, have I can do that. You have yeah, to I think, wait, wait, wait. I think you guys <laughs> can control yourself and you're trying to eat everyone and you're trying to taste everyone, everything in, on that plate. You can't just buy one thing and eat it. Like, you can manage to survive, right? Just with one plate. You don't so have, to, have eat to do everything. That? 
you have yeah. to you have to do like the teacher. She um I I, I do that too. I starve I st stay starve myself all day and I eat I at like four o'clock in the afternoon I go to the buffet and I eat like five plates. <laughs> <laughs> or okay, but I but, starve no, myself I, first. To be fair, you can have one plate as long as it's you know. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Like you take a, a little piece of everything and you go back and take a little piece of everything and you like you take five yeah. plates just like that. Yeah, but I know people. I know some people like they are trying to take everything <laughs> to with them and they can eat any of them. Like okay, now what? You are not a monster. You can eat all of them. You should should be thinking about that before taking all of that stuff. Yeah, but know? um, in France, they um, in the buffet, they when you leave food. And you like if you take food and you can't finish eating, you, pay you have to pay like an extra money. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's cool. Especially that's at really... sushi, right? Sushi. Normal at sushi <laughs> restaurants, if you go to an all-you-can-eat or a buffet sushi oh, yeah. place, then they charge you for the extra huh. sushi. Oh, yeah. 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 Japanese too. Yeah, I see what you're saying, Firkin, because it's really wasteful if you can't eat it yeah. all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. But if I you think... can eat it all, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I think I think when people go to eat to a buffet, people try to eat as much as they can. Uh -huh. I used to do that. I used to that to do that, but later on I learned that that was not good for me. Uh -huh. Well, when people go uh, very often, it's not good because you know later you're you're going to gain weight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's true. But yes, but for example, for seafood buffet, you have to take advantage of it because <laughs> you know is is the price is good and, uh, mm -hmm. to to enjoy as much as you can just for just for probably if if it is not too expensive, you can. But it's not like we're going to a buffet every week, right? No, yeah, that's right. <laughs> you just go once every few months. You're not going to go once a month. I think that this is psychologic. Like you say, like you go, you like you pay nine euro for all that food, and you say like. Wow, I have nine euro for all that, so I'm gonna eat all. Yeah, yeah. Gonna taste yeah. everything eat and just all. eat your 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 stomach full. <laughs> okay, good. Um. Yes. Oh, I have a question. Is no. oh. Okay, <laughs> Is um is smoking legal in restaurants in any of your countries? No. No. <laughs> no, no, not anymore. No. Yeah, I in think some so. places, just some places. Some places, some restaurants, yeah. Like in, mm -hmm. indoors, inside. Oh no, 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 mm -hmm. no. Not possible. Well, maybe, maybe in, some maybe, restaurants. Only maybe. on uh, summer uh, places. On you know. the patio yeah, outside. Yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. For example, mm -hmm. in Mexico, uh, for example, the same restaurant they separate and they in two sections. Mm -hmm. There's one for people who want to smoke, or people who smoke in a room. Yeah. Like that uh, smoking Smoke section. section. Smoking mm -hmm. section. Mm -hmm. Not smoking? We no, used to have no, it like no. that in Canada, but now it's banned. Like 10, 15 years ago, it was it was like that with the two sections. But mm -hmm. now you can't smoke indoors at all. How yeah. was it like when you go to the, the smoking sessions, like a factory? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, coughing smoke, like steam train. But the thing was that there would be a divider, but maybe not yeah. a very good divider. <laughs> it's like two different worlds. But the smoke <laughs> is still coming over into the non-smoker area. <laughs> so... Mm -hmm. Um, okay, well, maybe one more question. How about, um, Christelle, why don't you choose our another question for us? Um, okay, so uh, what is the most, um, I don't know which one to choose. Let me see. 
Uh, what's the worst experience you ever had at a restaurant? Ah, okay, found one. My friend had one. Okay, my, what happened? My <laughs> friend was going to eat something, and um, unfortunately, my other friends uh, pulled a prank on him. And uh, instead of giving salt, they gave him sugar. Oh my so god! Filled with sugars and started eating. And said, "Wow, that's that's weird." Then he just threw <laughs> it out, and he paid like nine dollars for that food. Oh no! And Anastasia found a hair in her food. She's telling us in the chat that sounds disgusting too. <laughs> <laughs> what else? Can I say, Any other? Can I say something about about my worst experience? Yeah. Uh, Yes, of course. Okay. <laughs> let's, let's, let's imagine this scene, okay? This scenario. Okay. I was in London four years ago, and uh, I desperately, I was desperately looking for an Italian restaurant. Mm -hmm. Okay. Victoria Station. There is, a, there is an Italian, uh, there is an Italian uh, restaurant, okay? Okay. I went there. And the owner is a, is an Indian man. Okay, this is the first the first uh, surprise for me. It, okay. It, okay, I am not a racist, but uh, an an owner an an Indian man who is the owner of Italian restaurant is. And to you, you're like, whoa, this is Italian food. There needs to yeah. be an Italian they, guy. Right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I, I agree. I okay. I can see that. Yeah. Okay. I I said okay. I I'm hungry. I I have to eat pasta. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I order uh, a plate of pasta, a uh, pasta dish. But they they brought me uh, pasta that it was completely overcooked. <laughs> and I said okay. You can you can take this this pasta dish and you can you can go to India and or oh. you you have to you have to go in Italy uh, in order to uh, to cook uh, pasta properly. <laughs> yeah yeah because like, I think this is a sort of sacrilege. Uh, yes, pasta is is just like I don't know the Colosseum in Italy. Yes. Uh, now every I, time I hear Giovanni say pasta, it's like pasta. Oh, there's like gold <laughs> coming out. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I, I think, think that. that yeah, it, it's a sort of privilege uh, to to cook pasta in the. Do world. you guys, do you guys agree that a specific type of cuisine should be run by? The, the someone from the country where the food comes from, like an Italian should cook the Italian food at the Italian restaurant, and mm. an Indian guy should cook the Indian food. Do you agree? What do you guys think? No, 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 no just, just not necessarily. Uh, no, uh, <laughs> yes, I agree. I agree that, for example, an Indian man could could run an Italian restaurant, but yeah. you have to cook properly. Yes, I uh, yes. Yeah. What do you guys think? Does everyone agree? As long as you know what you're doing, then it's fine. <laughs> then this, yes. This is I agree. Okay. <laughs> um, maybe before we go, one more horror story. Does anyone else have a, a good story from a restaurant? Oh, nothing. No. I didn't have any because me, I'm a pain in the ass when I go to a restaurant. <laughs> and uh, you make sure that everything is the way that you want it. Okay? Yeah. So, <laughs> I'm okay. not disappointed. Uh, I was poisoned before because of the food. <laughs> uh, food poisoning. <laughs> food poisoning scares me. I've never actually had it, but... You don't have to give us any details. <laughs> <laughs> when I get home. Um, well, I just gave you guys my Facebook. Does anyone have any questions for me before we go? Did you have a, a bad experience? Me, Christelle? Yeah. Did you have um, one? Nothing that really stands out. No, not really. Just, you know, little things. 
Like something, okay, okay. they bring you the wrong meal and you just uh. say, this is, and then, you know, but it's not really, no. When they bring me the wrong meal, I eat in it and I said that this is, this was <laughs> the right meal. You're just like, oh, well. <laughs> <Just eat it>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Um, okay, cool. Well, I'll, hopefully I'll see you guys later in the week. Thanks for coming. It was fun. Good talk. <laughs> See you. Okay. Thank Bye. You. Bye. 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 Bye.